All right, what's up, ladies and gentlemen? It's Super here, and welcome back to another MKX video. And today we're gonna be playing with Lackey Ferator. Damn, look at this costume! Look at this costume, the Executioner costume for Ferator. And you actually get the black cloak over his head because I'm using a variation that's not ruthless. This variation right here is the uppercut variation. This is the launcher. This is the combo variation. Well, the other one, you got combos too. But in this variation, you you get a straight-up launcher. Not only that, but you get the uh, down one without fair on your back. So you get that six-frame down one. Absolutely amazing. So leave a like on the video for some more Ferritor action. Oh, yeah, and I get that overhead too. Oh, drop my combo already. He's using Quan Chi Chi. Oh god. Come here. Let me hug you. Oh, that gets rid of projectiles. That's right. That gets rid of one projectile. Oh my god. The clothesline from hell, baby. Ah. Oh my god, I almost got him. Come here. Let me grab you. Oh. Ah. Oh, that's a bad move. Whoa! I forgot he had that brutality. Oh, that's so sick. In this variation, I'll actually be able to end with that brutality quite a bit because I have the launcher. I forgot about that brutality completely. That reminds me of who was it? Oh, that's right, Fujin. Fujin has the brutality in MK11 where you launch them up real high and then they just come down while screaming i think it makes her head explode right there too but this one this one was sick all right next up mm. let's go with the defaults you could only see one red eye the other one is in there you could, you could still kind of see it but it's not glowing does that mean he could only see from one eye or is only does only one glow. Oh man. All right. Let's see, we could keep on going with these combos. The one good thing about this variation is you don't need to punish yourself to get good damage. You get 39, 37 to 39% damage easy without doing the pain and gain. Well, although pain and gain, it's worth it, man. It's definitely worth it. But this variation, you get no downside and you get Round the uh, the launcher. Fight. Man, grab. Ah, dropped it. Oh, that's right, that's plus. Overhead. I'll do the wake up. Nice. I was just gonna go with the Sagger, but you know what? Let's finish the full string. Some extra chip damage. Round two. Fight. Oh, dove right into it. Nice 
quick punish. Aw, oh, man. Ooh, the range. Oh, come on. Ah, there we go. <laughs> Do I get any brutals? Nah, not really. Sorry, Grandma. You're gonna have to finish this game off. <laughs> Blanche was right there, but I hadn't gotten any interactables, so you actually have to use up two interactables before you can use Grandma in a brutality. So, hadn't done that, so you know what? Let's just close the game out. But I fucked up on that last bit. I should have... I shouldn't have done the, um, the neutral jump punch. Uh, it becomes a little bit harder when you do neutral jump punch just because it takes away some of the gravity. So I think it's best for me to just do forward two and then switch to the other side and then continue doing the combo how I normally would do. That's why I dropped because too much gravity had been used up. All right, so this guy is going to get his salty Sonia, run Sonia, back. Sonia, Sonia Sonia He's going to get a salty run back. He's going to go with Sonia. I'm sticking with my executioner, Lackey Ferrator. I forgot who he played, Devorah, I think. Play with Devorah. And he was messing up his cancels. Obviously, we're all just hopping on MKX once in a while Round one. to play, you know, not really taking it too seriously. Ooh, the instant. Does she get a combo? Okay, so he is going to do dive kick no matter what. What? Went for the grab? After a block down one? Okay, I, I do not believe that. That was my fault. Yep, I knew that was coming. I knew that was coming. Because I had woken up every time. So he's probably like, you're, uh, you're going to wake up again, aren't you? Let's go, baby. Woo, that's what I'm talking about. All right. I told you he was going crazy. So all I had to do was just slow my game down a little bit. Slow my game down, punish the dive kicks, which is really easy. It had, the dive kick has almost no whiff recovery, meaning that if they miss, Sonia recovers almost instantly. But if you block it, obviously, it's like super punishable. So just slow your game down. Throw out the down ones. Take your turn. Stagger back one, two. And you should be fine. All right, got this dude again. I think that's three in a row. So next time that I get him, I'm going to have to avoid him. Or I'm going to have to back out just because I want some variety. 
All right. Here we go. Unless he beats me. If he beats me, then we got a new ball game going. But if I beat him again, then we're going to have to avoid. All right. Lackey Ferritor. Throwing out some more overheads is something that I need to do. I'm just not used to having that. There we go. Finally, I actually do a freaking combo. Oh. Oh. That's the max damage that you could get with Ferrothor. I just suck at the conversion. Whoops. That's what I want. Oh gosh. <laughs> Patience. That's right, Ferritor. Pump yourself up, Tor. Hoping that you could do a combo with that. I mean, I've never tried that before, so I had no idea. Oh my god, he actually did it? I thought it was supposed to go under highs. I know my I have a big ass body, but it's supposed to go under highs. Watch this. Shit. Try to poke out of that. Oh my god. I thought he was going to grab This is bad news, guys. Nice anti-air! God, that was sick. <laughs> See, the reason I did a down two is because I thought he was going to do the ball roll, right? So my down two, if it would have traded that 12%, he was still going to take from the down two. It would have finished it. That's a good strategy if you think your opponent is going to wake up with armor. If they have under 12%, 12% under, do an uppercut. If you trade, they will take all that damage. So I did it down too, but this guy woke up grab. What a savage. He did wake up grab. Damn, for being such a savage, that's what he gets, man. He gets that down two right to the chin. All right, you know, I was going to avoid this guy, but we'll give him one more just because it was a really exciting match. The last match was really exciting, so we'll give him one more game. Kitana. All right, the princess. We'll give him one more game. 
If he could beat me, then I will play him again if I get him again. If I beat him, then I'm sorry, man. I'm going to have to uh, do the old back outs. Round one, fight. <laughs> Yeah, I got multiple armor hits. Oh god. I was trying to backdash that. I know you can backdash it. Maybe not for her too, who knows. Reminds me of a uh, of Perry's from MK11 split and all that. Oh god, I just got clipped. I'm trying to match on my down one, it's not gonna work all the time. I just need to get out of the corner, to be honest. Alright, nice. With this big-ass body, I need to get out the corner. Final round, fight. Oh, shit. I got jailed into it. Oh, come on. Oh no, I thought I was going to be out of range. This is not good, guys. He got me. Oh, man. I, I definitely underestimated this guy and his katana. 100%. I was not blocking. I was like, katana's not going to hit me from this far away, is she? Yes, she is. Damn it, man. Oh, well, he got me. So that means that if I get him again, I won't back out. Only if he picks Katana, though. If he picks any other character, then I'm backing out. I finally, we got somebody else. Is this person going to pick Shinnok? Katana. Ooh, Katana again. Damn. I just had a really bad experience playing versus Katana, so... Hopefully, we could get the W on this one. All right. One thing I will say, I, I don't think Ferritor could actually backdash the the uppercut meter burn that she has. Like the float uppercut meter burn. I don't think he could backdash it. I think it's, he's too big. I could armor. But most people could backdash it. Yeah, I got a block, man. Hit my combos. Oh, I thought she was gonna stagger. The damage. Wasted a bar for nothing. Okay, I was out of range. Damn. It seems like every thing that she does, I'm like slightly out of range. Oh, nice block. Ah! Oh, 
Am I gonna get the meter to break? No, I'm not. I'm still alive though, for now. Man, again with the down one <sighs> you know what he stayed patient though because I was mashing on my down one because I thought he was gonna maybe go in for his offense my down one is only like minus three something like that minus I think it's minus six but it's a six frame down one so I was like mashing it to see if I could take my turn back but he stayed patient he actually blocked like three of my down ones so Stay patient. I got to give him props. Without the boss toss, getting in with Ferritor and, like, actually staying in is definitely difficult. We got to get back on track, Lackey Ferritor. Let's Ferritor. go back to that Executioner. This is definitely my favorite costume that he has. Oh, look at the hooks, man. This is a crazy-ass costume. Triborg. Triborg. All right, let's do this. Lackey Ferritor, let's bring this back, man. I don't have that amazing neutral jump punch, but I do have some other benefits of playing this character. So we gotta put them to good use. Round one, fight. That was my fault. Oh shit, where's my down one? Holy shit, man. Hmm, no. No attack. Probably shouldn't have woken up right there. Nice. That was a uh, frustration attack right there. Keep him in the corner. This is where I want him. I don't know what to do as far as like corner combos, so that's why I didn't do it much there. Oh no! Shit, I did the wrong thing. I was supposed to be back there. Let's go! That did it? Let's go, baby. Mm. 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 After the bad katana match, or actually, there weren't really bad katana matches. I just, it's just a hard matchup. So it felt good winning this one.
All right, let's see if we can make this the final one with good old Ferator. What is the alternate color for the executioner on Lackey? I think I get a red sash, right? Jason Voorhees. I got a red potato sack on top of my head. All right, we got Jason versus Ferator. What variation Jason was that? I think it's Relentless Jason. I didn't see a chain around his neck. Yeah, I think it's Relentless Jason. All right, here we go. Ooh, that color's nice. Oh no, it's this variation. Yeah, I can't be mashing. This is not Jason's down one. This is not Jason's down one, where it's like minus two. Shit. Nice, good counter poke with the meter burn. Nice, Jason. See, this guy's playing pretty safe. And when he did an unsafe thing, he had meter burn to back it up. This is a good way to play Slasher. Merry Christmas, Jason. I know not too many people care about you, but... Yeah, he keeps getting whip punished. Better stop jumping. He has to stop jumping in because I'm gonna whip punish the hell out of him every time. Let's go, baby. That was a nice uh, slasher Jason, though. I'll give him that. That was a nice slasher Jason. But this grappler comes out on top. Ferator for the win. Thank you so much for watching today's video, ladies and gentlemen. And I will see you guys next time. What's going on? It's Super here. And thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did and you aren't subscribed already, make sure you guys do so. And if you want to see some more, there's videos popping up on the screen right now. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.